Good evening, SFL Nation. Welcome to the East Coast and Carolina for tonight's game here live at David A. Richardson Memorial Stadium as the Carolina Skyhawks with their first ever playoff home game against the Tulsa Desperados. Good evening, everybody. This is Chad Rowland, your play-by-play -play commentator. It's out. Drops, looking deep down the middle again. It finds his target. That is across the 30. And that is Heath McDaniel Jr. with the first catch of the night. And that is a good snap, good hold. The kick is up, and it is good from 40 yards. So Carolina getting some points there on their first drive of the night, which is for 386 yards this season and two touchdowns. So he is a target for sure. Gun split formation, Q looking down the middle again. It is tipped away, and that is going to be Ooh. picked off. There for Carolina. They get the first turnover of the game, and that is Skippy Curtis with a pick. Skippy Curtis. Bread baskets wide open. The ball just falls right in. Let's take another look at it. JQ has the route right there. That is deflected. That's Lincoln Kingsey, number 47, that got it. Looked like a forearm on the ball. Down the road. First to 10 from the 21. South looking, and that's going to be, and that's going to oh. be an interception right there. That is Philadelphia Collins with the pick, and Tulsa gets it right back. Looking like he's going to change the play, look for an out route at the top of the screen. There is that out route at the top of the screen. That's Gabe Manning. He's able to turn up the field, get a first down and more, past the 40 to the 35. Good change of play there by JQ. First and 10 from the 35, 350 to go here in the first. Drops back. He's going to look for Douglas Brown. That's going to be a catch, and he's going to be able to spin out of that. He oh. does a little juke move, gets a first down. Down to the 22, and Tulsa is just outside the red zone. Split twist formation here. Overestimated made it that football, that fullback speed a little bit. And looking over the middle again. That is caught, and Tulsa scores. That is game manning touchdown, Desperados. Or heavy set formation here out of the single back. Tulsa trying to bring the heat. They're going to try to do that screen. It is. Ooh, look at McBride there. Was able to break the wow. tackle and got hit hard for all the hard work. South drops back, looking for the out route, finds his target. That's going to be a first down out to the 33. Matt South is spreading the love around. Six completions for six different receivers. That's going to be Ike McBride again on the screen pass. It just, wow, it just barrels through there. Man, I got to tell you, I don't know. Work with Swift might be uh -oh. and Oh, no. Ike McBride is down. Marco Swift was on the receiving end of that Ike McBride hit, and now McBride going down, take another look at it. Nice little screen pass over the shoulder grab. That Marco Swift, Whoa. good night. And then it's number 54, David Ware, that brings McBride down. And you see her landing. You see Ware landing on McBride's legs. Tulsa's going to try to bring the pressure. Sal drops back, looking over the middle, finds his target. And that's going to be just short of the goal line here on the goal line. First and goal from the one. And that is going to be a handoff to Hattori Hanzo. And they're going to mark him in the end zone. Touchdown, Carolina. Yep, first and 10 from the 30. South drops back, looking deep over the middle. And that is oh, going to be boy. intercepted. And that's Marco Swift. When you try to throw deep in the middle of the field with Tulsa, Marco's usually there to clean that up. Yeah, Marco playing just center field all by himself. Seeing McDaniel coming over. Wide receiver on each side of the formation with Douglas Brown in the backfield. Q drops back, looking, finds the out route. That is Hume. That's going to be a first down. That's to the 38. Low snap. And, oh, I thought that was going to be blocked. And the kick is up. And it is good from 50 yards out. So Tulsa ties this ball game up here in the middle of the second quarter. Two wide receivers there at the bottom of your screen. And it's going to be a quick throw. And that is going to be another first down. And once again, that is McDaniel Jr. Being able to barrel through one or two defenders. That's going to be a situation where Warren is going to go down to first contact. And look at Warren here, and he gets a good run there. That's going to be a first down and more up to the 22. Malone Brown coming out here to take the lead. Good snap, good hold. The kick is up, and it is good. 34 yards out. Second and 10. Looking like tight end flex. Q, short drop, looking over the middle, and that is going to be intercepted. That is Shravan Prasad, and that's the, that's the mistake that Tulsa did not need to make. Yep, split back formation here, second and nine. The front seven looking to bring the heat. South looking over the middle, and that is caught. That is going to be a first down 
out to the 15-yard line. That is McDaniel Jr. again, who crosses over 100 yards. Their discount on pizza here tonight in the stadium as Malone Brown's going to be coming out for the three points. The kick is up, and it is good. And I got to tell you, I mean, you know, Tulsa was trying to look to, you know, maybe try to, you know, extend their lead going into half. But Carolina, even with the turnover, makes the best of it getting three points. Six catches for 61 yards tonight for Gabriel Manning. Q drops back, looking. He's going to look for the out route. He's going to find it, and they're going to try to spin out to get the first down. But Hume does not do that. He's going to be just short, second and one. And in the point set, they might try and do that anyway. Bunch formation there. That's going to be a handoff. Actually, Douglas Brown, he's got a little bit of room. Gets the first down. Almost tries to break out of that tackle there by DJ Majesty, but was able to hold him up. First down, Tulsa. Nine attempts for 31 yards tonight for Brown. First and 10 from the 35. Three wide receiver set. Q, short drop, looking on the slant route. Finds Gabe Manning. That's going to be a first down, and Tulsa is now in the red zone. Fourth and seven here from the 16. Low snap, and she's able to get the kick up and good from 33. So Tulsa inching closer. South trying to do a hard count here to see if they'll jump. Drops back. The pressure uh -oh. getting to him. Chris Andrews again gets the sack there, and that's going to be third and long for the for the Skyhawks. On this five-wide set. Q. Drops back. The pressure coming to the middle, and he's going to get taken down there wow. for a sack. That is Phil Hall, the 12-season veteran, the three-time All-Star with his first sack of the night. May return. So far, Ike McBride has not returned. Keyword in that must have been May. Third and nine from the 37. Over the middle, finds his target, and that's the very dependable. And that's actually Harish Prasad. Warren to his left. South drops back, looking for the out route, finds it. And that is going to be just short of the first down, Chase Earl. Once or twice, maybe three times. Let's see what they do here. First and goal from the two. Travis Warren up the middle. Warren gets into the end zone. Carolina extends their lead. Touchdown, Skyhawks. He probably felt impulse to dump it off. Q drops back, and he got hit as he throws, but makes the catch there. That is Corey Jones. In the boot tonight, Ron Haynes. I could run in the stats truck. Q, third and inches, looking. Finds Gabe Manning for first down. And importantly for Tulsa, Gabe steps out of bounds. It'll be a minute 57 to go. Gun straight formation once again. Q drops back, looking deep over the middle. That is caught. That is bandit again. Love of everything holy. Put the ball in the air. Yeah, if you're going to score, you need to score right now. First and goal from the seven. Q drops back, looking for the out route. Finds Manning. He's there able to turn it to the end zone. And that's a touchdown, Tulsa. This game is not over yet as he moves the crowd. Gabriel Manning, the only player to find the end zone for Tulsa today. Does it again against double coverage, slips inside the pylon. And here we go. Let's see what they can do. Here's Bubble oh, Round. And oh, and they got it. Tulsa got the ball. Tulsa got the ball back. And look, don't look now, but Tulsa's got a shot. Jay Rock with the recovery. This is going to go off the Carolina helmet. That's Lincoln Kingsey's helmet. Hey, Jay Rock right there to scoop it up. It's kind of a surprise move here from the defense. Yes. Second and two from the 19. Q looking deep in the end zone. That is picked oh up. Defense to Joseph. His third pick of the night. And he's going to try to take it down past 30. And Carolina just sealed the deal. You got to be kidding me. Oh, my you God. You got a field goal. You got a chance to tie the game. But you're going for the kill shot. Davidson Joseph right there on Gabriel Manning. He's almost in triple coverage. Wow. Davidson Joseph, third pick of the night. He had two already. You're going to throw to him again? And they are 18 seconds away from not only their first playoff victory, but their first home playoff victory. And Carolina has got a lot to celebrate here as they will advance to the next round to take on the Arizona Scorpions. I mean, I don't even know what to say, man. I'm, <laughs> I'm at a total loss. I'm at a loss. First of all, congratulations to Tulsa on a great season.